Let's have a look at, uh, this is still practice three, it's question two B, question two, not very difficult, but it should not take a long time. We're gonna do B. The question is write an inequality to describe the shaded region in each graph. Well, they've given us the line, and then they've shaded it, so we need to change that equal sign to, in this case, it's a solid line, so we're gonna change it to greater than or equal to, or less than or equal to, and the way we're gonna check that, let's use zero, zero. So if we put zero, zero in there, we're gonna say zero. Let's leave the sign out for a minute. And we've got zero plus zero minus one. So zero is greater than minus one. And because it's a solid line, I'll put greater than equal to. So that would mean that we'd need to change this equal sign to greater than or equal to, and that is that area there because we chose a point inside that area, zero, zero. Right, that would be true, right? If y is zero, then that would term is zero. This is zero and minus one, so y is greater than or equal to minus one. That would be that region. So let's write that. We're gonna have y is greater than or equal to 0.5x squared plus 2x minus one. And that is our answer for b. Okay, though, for your, when you do 2A, B, uh, C, and D, I'd like you to go one step further and make sure you put the check in. So double check again. We are going to use this point here, zero, zero. It's in the region. We think that's the answer. We're gonna prove it's the answer by putting zero in there. So at this point here, at zero, zero, we have zero is greater than or equal to zero plus zero minus one, and that's true. So that's okay. Make sure you do that check step as well and add it to your exercise book.